And the big questions answered in the appearance of uh, Boyd and McNamara on that team sheet. Tom Boyd replaces Olivier Tebele, and Jackie McNamara gets the nod for the central midfield pair in the absence of the suspended Alan Thompson, with uh, Lugo Moravcic held in reserve on the bench. It's a mouth-watering prospect, this Eric, is it not? Oh, it certainly is, Rob. It's a wonderful, wonderful atmosphere. It's really... Nearly six minutes gone. The BBC live match. Ajax nil, Celtic nil in the Amsterdam Arena. Yakubu. Muscled out of it there by Chris Sutton. Keen to play football out from the back. The Nigerian, but... Uh, Sutton wasn't having it. Lambert and Lennon combine, they do it so well. Sutton, good touch. That's useful. And Grim panicked. Petta! Celtic are ahead! The Dutchman puts them in front in Amsterdam. A bad mistake by goalkeeper Grim, living up to his surname. 1-0 Celtic. Oh yeah, it's a wonderful turn from Chris Sutton, he took the ball in so well, protected it so well. Here we see it here, Rob, his first touch is excellent, he knows where he wants to put it, lovely clip. Goalkeeper panics completely, he could le let that go through, but what a wonderful composed finish by Bobby Pepper, what a wonderful start for Celtic. Just placed into the roof of the net by Bobby Pepper, such a miserable season last season. Injury denied him a lot of action. But that is a sweet moment as he returns to his native country and fires Celtic ahead. And certainly scored again. And they have a set piece opportunity here. McNamara and Petter over the ball. Bobby Petter's cross is wicked. It's off the crossbar. It's pammed away by Grimm. Ajax survive and Celtic within inches of going two ahead 16 and a half minutes he's been busy and beaten once already free kick given against the late Celtic challenge there quickly taken and Neil chose to pick him Olivier Tebele the player to miss out he's been in the back three for Celtic's first two SPL games Larson Drilled ball to Agat, he's away from Shivu, Didier Agat has scored! It's 2-0 Celtic, 19 minutes gone, superb pass from Larson, then it was down to sheer pace and precision on the finish, Grimm beaten for a second time. Oh, again, great striking partnership, certain wonderful layoff, Larson is pinched perfect into Agat's feet, and what wonderful pace to get in front of the defender, and a very composed finish what a wonderful goal here we see him again great pace lifts his head knows where he's going to put it side puts it across the goalkeeper and it's safely into the back of the net real quality as well on that volley pass from Henrik Larsson and, and then Shivu was a beaten man you could see it in his face there he just couldn't catch a gap he had him for pace and that was a very cool finish Gats criticized sometimes for the quality of his finishing Mido for Ajax, into the box, headed away by Neil Lennon. To lift the players now, and it doesn't seem to be coming from anywhere, a very young squad, and it's showing at this moment in time. Lennon's free kick, finds Chris Sutton, Henrik Larsson! Well, that's more than half a chance in Henrik Larsson's book, and he's disappointed that he couldn't have made more of that well set up by Sutton. Undoubted ability. They've looked a very, very strong unit in the first half. Petri Pasanen played up to Nikos Maktas. Good control, good layoff. Ikeria cuts in. Gets the break of the ball. Here's a chance for Ajax. It's Maklas. Douglas pans it away. But it's forced in by Arveladze. Ajax pull a goal back. Six minutes from half time. And it's shot up Arvaladze, the man who came in from the cold, and he's reawakened Ajax hopes. Yeah, it was a wonderful burst of pace, a bit fortunate there, some slight defending from the Celtic players. Maclis turns, 
Douglas can only parry it to the side here. Wonderful turn by Maclis, doesn't quite catch it. Douglas stops it, might have hoped to get it further away, but good finishing, good following up from Aberladze, and that's the last thing Celtic needed just before half-time. That could prove to be a real shot in the arm for Ajax, and uh, immediately Rob Douglas gives the ball away with a poor kick out, and Celtic will want to get themselves settled down and start playing the way they were playing. Just ahead of the half-time whistle, Celtic so close here to going 3-1 ahead. That's a great stop from Sutton's effort. Yeah, it's a wonderful break forward from Valharan. Lovely ball in from Larson. Sutton can do no more. He's got on target and perhaps Grimm is made up from one or two of his earlier errors. That's a brilliant save when you look at it there by the goalkeeper. Here's the corner kick. Played in by Bobby Petta. Cleared, but only as far as Lennon. We've played 100 seconds of added time. And that's flicked away by Arvaladze. Pulls one back for Ajax just before half-time, but it's these Celtic supporters who are absolutely delighted with what they've seen so far, Eric. Yeah, wonderful performance from Celtic. Very professional, very disciplined, wonderfully inventive up front. Larson Sutton have been very, very clever. Petter in the wider area, fantastic. A guy, a real threat with his pace and his desire to get forward. And it's been an all-round really good performance. I just hope now that Ajax, having been given a, a boost there, obviously, 10, 15 minutes before the end, don't come out and change and possibly give more threats to Celtic. But I, I can actually see Celtic scoring. Yep, it certainly could have been a bigger lead for Celtic, but I don't think anyone inside that away dressing room will be complaining about the halftime. So you mentioned it when, during the game there, Craig. Uh, that's what you want your keeper to do. He's not called into action a lot, but uh, great save. Absolutely, tremendous save. Uh, it was a point-blank shot, but it was hit fairly straight, but... Lennon, Mido again, and out wide, Shivu. Early ball in. Chested back towards Mido. Celtic trying to stay firm at the back. That's a useful ball in from Mido. And well, Robert Douglas did well because that would have surprised many. He just whipped that in. And on this sort of surface, that could have been deadly. No, that's a very good take from Robert Douglas. He'll be happy with that. He didn't even look Mido there. He just he's eliminated the fullback. I think it was Agat. And he's whipped the ball in very quickly. Chance for Henrik Larsson. So close to 3-1 Celtic. Just 80 seconds gone in the second half, and again it's bad defending from Pisana and a dreadful mistake. And Henrik Larsson steering his shot wide of the post. He'll be disappointed not to have. He's very unfortunate just to pull it by the far post. Good play from Jakubu. Ibrahimovic threatening against Boyd. And that's a good effort from Arbeladze at the edge of the area. And that's cheered up the Ajax supporters dangerous coming onto the ball the Georgian yeah he's coming from deeper Rob so he's going to get presented with several shots